Hey, hey, what's going on? This is your boy coming at you with a quick how to make video. It's a pretty simple recipe. Um, been bartending since 1999, back in my Seattle days and <laughs> Las Vegas days. I'm going to be making a blue Hawaiian. Like I said, it's a pretty simple recipe. And uh, let's go ahead and do it. I'm going to get the simple base rum. Normally I would pour with both hands, but since I have to hold the camera and do this at the same time, let's get it. So we're going to pour in the rum. This is a fifth. So I think we're going to go ahead and put the whole entire thing in there. <laughs> so let's do that. Really not that much in the fifth. And this is a three quarter, three quarts picture that I'm putting it in. And the second ingredient is going to be called blue curacao or blue curacao, depending on what part of the country you're from. Everyone pronounce it, pronounces it differently. And this is a liqueur, an orange flavored liqueur for most. And we don't want it to dominate it, so we're going to look like a cleaning product. Huh? <laughs> so we're going to stop it right there. And that should be fine. I already took the liberty of uncapping these guys, so it'd be easier. We're gonna roll next with this sweet and sour. Put that in there. And we're gonna stop it about right, right there. And the last ingredient is good old pineapple juice. I already shook it up and everything, so let's go ahead and add that. As you can see, the color is changing from like this dark blue to like a greenish blue, which is pretty cool. So now, oh, that's my great nephew in the back background cutting up if you guys can see. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and tighten this up so I can give it a give her a little shake, a little shaky shake, and that's pretty much it. That is your classic blue Hawaiian. The only thing missing is some garnish and cherry and some lemons and that's it now i heard about this one here i'm going to make one more here on this video um this is called a cinnamon toast crunch and what what it takes is rum chata and fireball i never made this before but just go ahead and give it a shot and see what it does add a little bit of rum chata to that just a little bit and we're gonna add a little fireball to the concoction and that should be enough so what I'm going to do is take my other cup here and go back and forth like that hey how's it going brother and that's it and let's see what it tastes like man that tastes like some cereal that's so yeah, that's cool. It actually tastes like cinnamon toast crunch and that's what we're going for. Anyway, thank you and that's pretty much it. Yeah, we're all about.